Hi, what a science, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. In this reading, we're going to find out who's thinking heavily about you right now and why. Today is the 30th of December, 2022. Time is 3.01 p.m. here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. Now, please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for water signs. And if you were divinely guided to watch this video, this message is meant for you, even if you're dealing with the same water sign. Let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for water signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. Who is thinking heavily about water signs right now and why? The sun at the bottom of the deck. So this person could be a Leo, strong Leo. I'm seeing here Libra, Gemini, Aquarius with the Queen of Swords and the Ace of Swords in reverse. Hmm. You have a couple of people who whom could be thinking heavily about you right now. You have somebody at work thinking heavily about you right now. Something that they're unclear of, perhaps a certain order or <laughs> a job task. A uh, work task that they, they don't quite understand. That's just for some of you, okay? And then we've got the Queen of Wands here. You may have someone who is jealous of you, or could be a third party. Um, it could be, you know, the Queen of Wands, Six of Cups, and Wands. You have bad memories in regards to this person. I think um, you could have told this person off, cut this person off, or it could be vice versa. This person may have told you off or cut you off. Um, it's definitely like a bit of a rivalry I'm getting here, Queen of Wands, or it could be a third party, a love triangle, um, the other woman or the other man. That's just for some of you, okay? You do know that you're involved in a third party situation. The Hierophant, the Strength, and the Hermit here in love first. Definitely one person here is holding back from reaching out to you. This person looks like it's not communicating with you right now. This person could be a... Uh, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, or Libra, Gemini, Korea, strong, strong Leo again, and strong uh, Virgo, okay? So what I'm seeing here is that what a sign is, this is somebody whom you may have taught a lesson. Uh, either you told them, told this person off, or, or gave them peace of your mind, or cut them off. Whatever you may have said or done, this person will be thinking heavily in regards of what you've said, what you've done, uh, where I feel like they could have been getting some lessons out of it, okay? with the higher fight and the strand in reverse. The hermit in reverse, this person also could be feeling kind of lost right now. Um, it feels like they could be kind of walking aimlessly or thinking aimlessly, not knowing um, or not understanding. Ace of Swords in reverse, kind of like unclear about the whole situation. Maybe this person is reflecting as well. That's what I'm getting here. You have a child who could be thinking heavily about you right now. Some of you, if you're away, you're on a vacation, and you leave your child behind with your mom, with Empress your mom first, or a caretaker, or any anybody. But I feel like that's just for some of you, if you do have a child, okay? And then we've got the lovers here, mom first. Yeah, you have someone whom you may have prioritized your child over this person, and they could be thinking heavily about you right now. That part is very specific, and it's just and it's just for some of you. But I do see what a sign is. Someone you've cut off, and you knew that was the right thing to do, and you're prioritizing your happiness or your child. If you have a child, if not, it's just prioritizing your happiness with the sun here. I think this person actually resents you for it. Um, could be a little bit jealous of you. Some of you could be in the same gender relationship. Not all of you. But this person is trying to be very patient or could be holding back from talking to you about it or reaching out to you with the Knight of Pentacles. And there's an energy of somebody also, like, could be trying, wanting a commitment but don't think they can commit. Yeah, there's uncertainties. There are uncertainties or something that is not clear here with the high system of verse. Am I doing the right thing and should I do it or not? Because the Nine of Pentacles is such a slow energy, so this person will be moving slowly towards you off to offer you commitment or even friendship because they aren't sure 
they aren't sure if you're gonna reciprocate because of the Empress here and one first. The chariot can indicate someone whom could be traveling towards you, it could be traveling towards this person. This person will be thinking heavily about you right now. Some of you water signs, maybe you're doing well. If you're doing well for yourself and you're doing taking steps to achieving your goals and your dreams. There could be a hater here, Queen of Wands trying to copy you or jealous of you. Mm. Home could be thinking heavily about your the higher fund here, how you do it, how you did it, your formula. Could be kind of like, again, feels like they're, they're trying to copy you or trying to pull the same kind of strings or, um, or try to get to know people who know you, who could have some sort of connection with you to your success, okay? That's just for some of you. I'm going to pull out a few of these oracles. I'm starting to understand our connection. So there is a connection where I feel this person, yeah, may have lied to you. The Ace of Swords here, one first. Somebody whom could have lied to you could be thinking heavily about you right now. Maybe you have told them off with a higher fine. You punished them in some way, shape, or form. I wish I could share my good news with you. This is someone who doesn't really, isn't really happy. It's somebody who fakes being happy when you share good news with this person, yeah? Can't stop thinking about you. I left when I saw you with someone. Some of you, maybe this is this could be a romantic partner. Rumi is also kind of jealous because you could be connected with someone new. Yeah, the sun can you get newness as well, as like a new beginning. It was my fault, but I blamed you. I lost myself for a little while. Maybe they said something, did something in the past that now they are sort of regretting, right? I see them kind of reflecting. Well, this could be someone that you usually share your good news with, but I feel like deep down they're not really that happy for you. You could be happy for this person whenever they share good news with you, but it's not the same yet for them. That's what I'm seeing here. This person also could be thinking heavily about you right now because you have a new friend whom you are much closer or you have a new romantic partner. Um, and they can't stop thinking about it. They can't stop thinking about it. Um, I feel like, again, the lovers in one verse, this person you used to love or care about, but... This person is not really connected with you right now, currently, okay? What a science, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, this is your reading. I hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave you with a couple of playlists on the screen right now. The first one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. Check it out if you want to. And the second playlist is from this channel. It has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs with different topics and different questions different questions, but these readings are still new, so they're still relevant because I post them every single day. I upload them right away, so they are very fresh, very, very new, okay? Take care, Water Science. Hope to see you back here again later or tomorrow. Bye.